Hi, my name is Brenda, and today I'll be talking about four significant life events that have changed my life for the better. So I chose to talk about receiving my dog Pluto, one of my recent car accidents, my nephew being born, and moving out of my house. So my dog Pluto was born in Palm Springs, California. He is a Shih Tzu. Um, back in 2016, I really wanted a dog to have inside and just to have my own dog and he was gifted to me as a Christmas present when I came home from work um, back in December of 2016. Um, this dog is my world. I do love him very much. He is a very sweet and loving dog and he's a very good dog. He's so playful with other people. He doesn't bite. He's very well trained. Um, he loves to travel, so whenever we go in the car or we leave, he always wants to go with us. He has gone on planes with me. He has also traveled to other states with me. Um, he just has impacted my life in such a positive way that I cannot imagine life without him. Um, on the picture, on the two pictures on the right, the first one on top was 4th of July of 2017. And then this one on the bottom right is him at Huntington Dog Beach. He wasn't very happy that day because he doesn't like the water, but he had lots of fun. So in the next slide, we'll be talking about my car accident. So this one was very scary. I've been hit four times, and I think this one tops it off. Um, it was pretty bad, and it happened so fast. Um... I was just stopped on the freeway there was a lot of traffic going home and they were going about 60 miles per hour and they just rear-ended me um, the car spun and it was really nerve-wracking there were about four cars involved but it just made me appreciate life because anything can happen at any moment that happened so fast um, literally totaled my car so I don't have a car right now so we're, that's in the works never not had a car so it's been really hard to not drive and things like that but I'm grateful to be alive because um, in that moment it was very scary and um, you know anything could have happened but um, me and my family we were okay and then the next thing I'm going to be talking about was my nephew being born. So the picture, the first picture on the top was he was about a couple months old and he's just playing with my dog Pluto. Um, the second one in the middle, he was just born. And then this is one of the most recent ones, the third one on the bottom. Um, he's about three years old now. He was a pandemic baby. So I didn't get to meet him until he was about six months old just because I wasn't living with him at the time and the pandemic hit. So just to be safe, um, I didn't meet him until he was a little older. He is a very active little boy. He has taught me patience and it's really interesting watching kids grow up and it's really fun. And he's a loving little boy and I do love him very much. And yeah, he's just really great. And then the last thing I'll be talking about um, was me moving out of my house. Um, it was a lot more difficult than I expected. I moved out back in 2019. I was about 21 years old. And it was just a lot of responsibility. Um, I feel like I should have waited to move out. Although it did teach me a lot of good life lessons, um, how to be responsible, how to take care of myself. It's just really difficult money-wise and, you know, time management with work and school and all that. So I think I should have waited a little longer, but the freedom of moving out was nice. But yeah, that was, it was a really good life experience, I believe, to have moved out and experienced that on my own. But other than that, that's about it. And thank you for listening.